Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome back to the basement as I'm trying to squeeze in some viewing between the day job, covering for people, and my youngest had their wisdom teeth out. Didn't go so well. Didn't go so well, but we're doing better. Doing better, and I'm finally able to hopefully watch if not one episode, but at least two. Hell of a Boss, season one, episodes four and five, streaming now on YouTube, a very much copyright protected show. I will do what I can. I will always attempt to put something full length, but it has not been. Luck has not been on my side. Let's just say that. But I'm excited to get to it because I've been having a good time. Although I haven't noticed or I haven't found an overarching plot. Like, do we have a story goal for season one? It feels as if we're just spending a day in the life of these characters, which is fine which is fine, <laughs> but it makes reacting, I've noticed a little bit different because I'm just reacting to the moment and not going, ooh, this is gonna come into play later, unless it is, and we just don't know it yet. I guess the only way we'll find out is to watch the show. So thank you so much for being with me on this journey. We are going to get under the big cozy blanket. I have some water on standby because I got a lot more things to do today. Uh, hit subscribe if you haven't already. I would greatly appreciate it. And I've, at some point, I will put the full unedited watch along on Patreon. I just got to commercials, edit some commercials out. But yeah, go check it out over there. I know you're ready. I'm ready. Let's get to it. Oh, well, heaven! Howdy. I'm Cletus. Welcome to heaven. And good people deserve to give loved ones special blessings. Does it make you want to cry? When your loved one has to die. Does it hurt you through and through? When, when your face is turning blue. Oh. We can help keep them alive. So, so you can watch them thrive. Do sit right back and let us bless our soul for you. Oh, we are the CHU. Yeah, I was wondering, Cherub must stand for something. Uh, keep going, keep going, keep going. I say, I say, are you looking to get work making crazy contraptions? This is an Alistair Lucifer crossover. Guys, do you feel that? Oh shit, is that a hell shake? Don't panic, Moxie! I'm not panicking because hellquakes don't happen. <laughs> do not be afraid. Who are you and what do you want? I am Lucy Goofy. Just the inventor of all things loopy and loopish. You could have just used the door, dude. Doesn't need to be this whole thing. I am eccentric and must therefore do eccentric shit. <laughs> I know people like that. This is the man I'm gonna need you to kill. He was my business partner. My partner Lyle and I ran Lyle Luffy Robotics, a technological empire. Earlier today, we were testing a new machine intended to stop or reverse the aging process. Oh. Unfortunately, we neglected to test the machine on the poor, like we usually do. But the machine was accidentally set forward. It was too late, at least for me. Evil son of a bitch is going to take over the empire we built together! Yeah, that's not really evil. It's evil towards me! If we do kill him, though, and he ends up down here, you know, you will be stuck with him forever. Oh, trust me. I'm counting on it. Oh, that's how he wants to spend his eternity, is torturing his business partner. Ooh. <laughs> Let's do it, gang! Oh, they're not in there! Okay, I take it this is not their disguise disguise. Like in last episode, they're talking about the actual disguises. Goodbye, my one true love. All the riches of the world can't fill the emptiness I'm feeling now that my shitty old body can't do anything of value. Oh, fantastic. He's going to do our job for us. As I was thinking. <gasps> oh, he's going about it in interesting way. They got snacks. Oh no, he went to heaven. He's gonna get blessed. To grant you a blessing, 
on behalf of those in heaven, benefited by your amazing technological advances. Oh, hell no! Wow. Lyle Lipton, it is our humble opinion that you should continue the process to commit dying. <laughs> <laughs> to commit dying, ah. We can help spread his wealth around with the people of the world and do so much good with it. So who gets his money when he... I, oh, sounds like you need help off in your... <laughs> Moxie, what do we got for this fella? I have some assault weapons, crossbow, honey bow, tommy gun, old fashioned shotgun, revolvers, and three colors, chainsaws, katanas. He's classier than that. Classy. Love can be beautiful at any age. And we'll show him. Yeah! yeah. No! <laughs> God's gift of nature is a wonder to behold. You'd be missing all of this. Nature is no picnic up close. Oh jeez! <laughs> stop looking! I can't stop! I've never wanted to die more than I do now! <laughs> oh, more nature kills more nature kills more nature! <laughs> I just took a turn. That went to zero to a thousand. <laughs> Look at those sweet disease-ridden vermin. Their joy comes from innocence. Why is he got his snotty nose? Why are they all picking their nose with nose things? No, no, no! You can tell I've been around a lot of young boys. Wanna see whose lap you're sitting on? In a child wearing way, not my own children. No. <laughs> Place reeks of teenagers. Lovers, look out, sir! I've never been in love before. It's not too late, sir. You can still find. Ha! <laughs> nice try, ugly. Hey, horny lovers! Which one of you would fuck this old man? And you three are so superior to us just because we want some selfish, greedy, authoritarian capitalist to keel over dead! You're making things too real now, Moxie. <laughs> yeah, I saw what was said on the bottle. Behold! The wonder of art and music! How do we make these bad? We can't. There's literally nothing bad about opera. That's fact. <laughs> fact. That's it! I have had it! Monsters have messed with us enough! Enough! No! Oh. but dirt that shitty dead people tread on and now you're trying to meddle with the lives of humans filthy demons so are these little cherubs heaven born then or they're not humans that have went up to heaven they're, they're heaven born <laughs> Their love is pure. All starting to make sense now. People, run! Run. If creatures far beyond this living world are going through these lengths over my life, then certainly it's worth living. Plus, I'm still rich. I could just buy all the things. <laughs> oh, you job for us. <gasps> this is it over! <gasps> what the? <gasps> mm, yeah, no sorry, Cletus, but I'm afraid your actions resulted in the death of a human. I'm afraid you can't re-enter heaven, Ian. Is there anything we can do? Yeah, no. <laughs> Well, the old man wanted to live again, and we didn't kill him, so we failed. Thanks to those fucking cherubs, he's probably up in heaven now. When are you going to tell the client? Oh, I already sent him a text, and we're in good hands, because texts don't make people angry. Blitz! Lufa! We can explain everything. I was... 
<gasps> we thought you went to heaven. <laughs> heaven? You don't make millions in technological advances and robotics by not experimenting on the poor. <laughs> for reuniting me with my best friend. Did someone say I say inventors? I am looking for creative new people to exploit. I mean employ. Everyone stop fucking up my walls. Moxie's gonna have to fix all this shit. Oh, I said oh. No, I'm serious. Get the fuck out! Oh. Someone's had a sleepover. I have an engagement this month on the full moon. When? Oh! It is a scene. But do you really need the book for this farm <laughs> bullshit? I have like 15 new clients waiting for heads to roll. <laughs> that rope should not be so easy to burn through. The harvest moon is a very special occasion. It's been my annual duty to showcase it in the Ring of Wrath. Wrath, huh? My employees are from there. Why don't you all join me at the festival? I can guarantee you all special access. <laughs> I'm simply offering a work-free day of fun. Fun. If you promise this isn't some fuck fest invite. The Harvest Moon. Does sound like it could get very naked. What do you want, sir? Hey. How would you and Mills want to visit the Wrath Ring for some Harvest bullshit this year? We fucking all! <sighs> well, Millie likes the idea. Where are you calling from? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mama! Oh, Daddy! They're visiting home. Got it. Or at least Millie is. Thanks for letting us stay here for the Harvest Jamboree. We know you aren't making as much anymore since y'all went freelance. Freelance pays fine, Ma! So there's a more corporate corporation that does what they do? <laughs> Greetings, Lynn. Joe, how have you been now with all the flaming twisters and stuff? We lost our old farm hand to one of them terrors last week. <laughs> oh, oh, crumbs. Oh, crumbs. <laughs> you two raised a sturdy bitch. <laughs> so... Blitz, is it? That's a fine name. It reminds me of war. <sighs> oh, they are liking Blitz more than Moxie? Hmm. More battles were won by technological advances in warfare. I've researched the history of weaponry extensively. For example, the progression of guns utilizing angelic technology. He's trying so hard. Bad if... I mean... <laughs> Speaking of strong hands, y'all should meet our newest help. Well, howdy. Oh, looky here. You must be the famous Mildred. Snake-ish? Oh, so you're the bold imp that started his own killing biz. Not many imps start businesses on their own. That's pretty impressive, sir. Oh. Yeah, it is. I, I guess... I guess it is. What is this buttering up? There's a competition to be the roughest, toughest bastard in Wrath. Wish I could play. The last competition ended in 15 separate funerals. How come Sally Mae still gets to compete? Your sister doesn't have a neighborhood head count. Still, you get to root for her and your brothers, and now you can cheer on... Oh, there's a whole crew of them. You can also cheer for me. <laughs> Sorry, boy, but I don't think sensitive thespian types would last very long in the games. I was born here, too. I have some fight in me. I have some fight in me. will not you help me wrangle one of them hogs for dinner? Simple. Nah, with these. Bullets can't pierce a shell. Mox, you don't need to do this. Oh, he totally does. Take it fast, Moxie! Yeah! Yeah, you do it, Mox. I like Mox. I find him sweet. This is fucking beautiful. Doing great, Moxie! Send me that video later. Dude. Ow! My clavicle! <sighs> <laughs> Why is his arm in a bandage now when he hurt his clavicle? Who's this dude again? Greetings. 
I hereby welcome you all to another year of celebrating the spoils of your labor. Oh, there's a shark! <laughs> Again! Another shark! Is there a shark in the mud? Yes! <laughs> Like singing. I'd like to take this opportunity to sing a quick song I wrote just now. I wrote just now. Nothing <laughs> stick in heaven to the rugged rocks. <laughs> Isn't this guy great? It's gonna be nice working with him. <gasps> I asked him if he wants to join IMP. He's willing to leave the ranch. <laughs> Why are we at this door, Mox? Oh my crumbles! Genuine carmine crafted blessing tipped rifle! Carmine How in the fuck did he get one of these? Why don't you ask me? Carmine crafted! Why do you have this? You are aware this kind of weapon can kill. Demon royalty. No shit. That's kind of the point. He's gonna kill Solta. <laughs> <laughs> Can it kill just all demons, not just demon royalty? <laughs> Pathetic. Oh. oh, there we go, Millie. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. <gasps> Millie. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm not strong enough. Not with your hands, baby. Use what you're good at. I'm not good with my hands? <laughs> oh, right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Probably should have used this earlier. <laughs> I love you, Hud. But for fuck's sake. Get on with it. <laughs> the glow of the true harvest moon. Yeah! I told you. I told you. Ooh. Uh, excuse me, the fuck? Oh, wow. Blitz is there. You know, the two of us are superior than most of our kind. And you were so above sucking on a disgusting, rich, pompous Goetia, only to sneak topside for scraps and work for bitter sinners who could care less who you are when you could be slaying overlords. When you could partner up with me and kill the unkillable. Ooh, that's kind of hot. We could be the most dangerous beings in hell. For reals? Huh? Took you long enough, Mark! Face. <laughs> oh, okay, oh. cliche much. Oh, you daddy fucker! <gasps> you seem to have forgotten something, fucko. Oh, Luna! Luna! Oh, fucking damn it, Luna. No! <laughs> You miss. You're wasting a lot of potential relying on. They're letting him talk too much. You gonna that. finish that fucking sentence? Who's weak now, bitch? Hey, <gasps> okay, I'm here. Maybe you'll get me next time, Blitzy. I thought we we're gonna have a cliffhanger there for half a second. You two are getting on a case about being hurt by a psychopath you hired? Shame on you. Wow, he nodded. Well, they're staying at a motel instead now. Oh, this is what's his name. It won't happen again. It better not. I want this cheating prick dead. Make it happen! <gasps> They're right there. But <laughs> I'll get him next time. <laughs> hmm. 
So Mrs. Stolas or is still living with Stolas or a hit and is talking about it at the dinner table in front of them. <laughs> and he's unaware. Blissfully unaware. Wow. Wow. I think Stolas, I enjoy him greatly. Moxie, I also enjoyed. I think the two of them are kind of up there as my favorite characters. Just because, I don't know why it is, but I'm drawn to them. The obliviousness, <laughs> Stolas and him just flying his freak flag out there. Doesn't care. And then Moxie tries so hard and he loves his wife so much. <laughs> I think that's why I enjoy him as well. So we have a cliffhanger. <laughs> two. I guess we have two. With the hit still out. And then we have the cherubs. The cherubs are now trapped on Earth. They're not going to go to hell. And are we going to see the cherubs again? And what does cherub stand for? Because it looked like it was an acronym. Is that the word? C-H-E-R-U-B. Cher um, yeah. So what does that stand for? And are where they heaven born? And they can't go back. Now I know some of y'all have said that humans when they die go to the pride realm and they pretty much stay on the pride realm. They can't they can't go back and forth. Although it looks like humans are making it to whatever this realm is to hire the IMPs. Right? They are. So humans humans must be able to travel somewhat. Yeah, that part I'm not too clear about. Does it matter? I don't know yet. <laughs> so at least now I have in my head an objective, not a goal, something to look out for. How many more times is Stoles gonna be happened? Is he gonna be merged? We'll have to look out for it and see. And will Blitz ever just be like fine with the relationship <laughs> on a level of, okay, fine. I care about you more than just you giving me the grimoire to do my job. And there was an intonation that there was another company out there that does something similar or a different organization. Will they come into play? Ooh, so there's lots to look forward to. And I can't wait to get to it, especially along with all of you, you, you are what's making it so much fun. So until next time, please take care of yourselves. This is your reminder to go stand up if you haven't in a while. Also to breathe, just take a nice deep breath. Go get something to eat and then come back and watch the next video in the queue. So thanks again, y'all, and until next time.